Now, you might be getting itchy feet and planning a move overseas to start a brand new career. So that's why this latest survey by HSBC on expats all around the world might provide you with a few ideas of where to go. Well, the survey polled more than 9,000 expats from all around the world and asked them a series of questions on anything from quality of life to where you can earn the most money. It also found out the top five occupations for expats around the world. You can see there number 17, number one with 17% Banking, insurance, and the financial services industry was the top occupation for expats anywhere on the globe, followed closely by education, 11%, and a three-way tie, uh, two-way tie, 9% for telecoms, IT, and internet, and uh, construction and engineering, and marketing, media, and creative industries at 8%. Well, what are some of the reasons why an expat might want to head overseas? Well, top job. 38% that was to improve their jobs prospect that was followed closely uh, with a three-way tie again 31% uh, to have a new challenge 31% to be with family or a partner and of course 31% to hopefully at least uh, try to improve their quality of life and the 20% all about those dollars 20% of people moved overseas to try to earn a little bit of more money. Well, let's take a look at some of the, the top findings from this HSBC poll. Number one, coming out at the top spot for expats anywhere on the globe is Switzerland. It said a good work-life balance, quality of life, and of course, that uh, very beautiful scenery there in Switzerland is probably a good reason. China is the home to the highest earning expats in the world. Italy, pretty romantic place, so why not? 57% met their partner while living in Italy. And uh, if you get tired from all that work, just head over to Canada. That, high, that is the most popular destination for retired expats. And probably asking, what about right here in the UK? Well, expats here spend more time socializing with locals than any other expat country around the world. So, uh, Louisa, uh, I'll see you down at the pub in just a little bit.